So yeah, I'm not uh, riding alone today. I got invited by one of my viewers. So we are in Mateng, north of Chiang Mai. And here we have Maku. Hi. Today, He's... the old man versus the young man. <laughs> yeah, and who is the old man? Maku is very uh, experienced. He's been riding a lot up here. So he's going to show me some really nice trails and tips and tricks. And uh, let's go out there and have a good day.
bamboo stuff in there. Yeah, some bamboo stuff there in that tree. The taller bike, and I have taller. No, it's, I can go. It's uh, I have to lie the bike down. You won't go, yeah. Thank you. anything like that. Let's see if we can find some alternative stuff, these bamboo sticks. Ah, I would definitely fall into the creek and that would be hard to get the bike up. It looks uh, a little bit less than half a meter or something but it depends on how soft it is. Ah shit! <laughs> it's quite deep. Yeah, my bike doesn't like too much water. Or... Yeah, and I general, I had a lot of bad experience and this stuff come in the cup. Looks like we can't find an alternative crossing, so we're probably going back. We don't feel like lifting bikes too much. So my bike is much taller than my KLX. I am a lot taller. And my bike is almost 25 kilos heavier. Then I am a lot heavier. And a lot more fit. The best I can do something about. I really like this view. The rice fields and the mountains. Fantastic.
Good fun. Okay, we're back at uh, Maku's house and uh, we need to refuel my two stroke and I had to eat some uh, energy bars and drink a little extra. We've been out there two hours already and actually I'm surprised how much fuel I have still have left. But we're gonna go for one more run and now we're gonna go to where he's usually riding. The rocks and crap that I really, really like. So he's gonna show me how to do. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> Just fill this one up with a couple more liters then I'm good to go. Don't believe him. He is the go. He is the bro, <laughs> not me. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm the pro. I'm only the, I'm only the guide here to show. <laughs> and the funny part is I've been uh, riding behind Maku all day almost. This uh, the nose is very dirty on, yeah, on you. It's, yeah, my nose is full of dust and my throat and everything. But what I was about to say is Michael is standing up, as you have seen, all the time. He don't need a seat. I think we take it off so it's, his bike is lighter because he's always standing. And that is actually good, but I don't know how he can be. <laughs> okay, now we pull. Good way of uh, practicing control and balance. Oh. Yes. Oh. I'm very tired now, so we are starting to get on our way back. And I'm gonna try Marcus KLX. And the first impression is it's very, very small if I compare. <laughs> Funny. Very different clutch, too. Holy crap, his uh, pegs are. I have my knees close to my ears, it feels like. <laughs> Oh god, it's so tiny! Oh, gear. First gear go out. Did this here. And it's still clutch is engaging first millimeter, which is not the case for mine. And I can really feel that it's 25 kilos lighter than my bike.
so many riders here in Thailand use these bikes. Most of them are on average shorter than I am. So then it's a lot easier. But the torque is incredible if I compare it to my bike. Because I don't have any bottom end compared to this one. So all done, this uh, ride is over. It was uh, two and a half hours, 62 kilometers. So that is a lot more than I usually do. And uh, very different trails and style of riding. I actually didn't have to uh, refuel because we were only doing half an hour after that. So that would have been enough. But I'm uh, happy with myself that I didn't totally die. And I learned a lot from the new kind of trails and uh, things to ride. And I'm happy that my bike didn't have any issues either. I'm very glad that I put on my old half waffle grips because otherwise I would have been dead in my hands. Overall, this was a really great day and I'm happy for that. So this is it for this video. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye bye.